Morning. Hi, how are you doing? All right. Rob, you didn't put anything up front? No, I don't have anything really. Just. What do you get on the little pocket tool? Uh, what is it? Oh, that's five. Uh, thanks. Thanks so much. Hi. Hi. Hello. Yeah. Yeah, you too. Got a friend for a game boy. Yeah. And that when you were a kid, right? Yeah. 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 So I'm just buying the spare parts. It doesn't have any parts. It doesn't function at all. It's just spare parts. For one buck. Okay. Well, you get extra buy. <laughs> An extra single. Thank you. Yep. Thank you. Thank you, ladies. Take what you want, baby, be my big spender. Unleash a tie this night is nothing like tender. Gamble and win, play the cards well and rough. They control my sugar. Just got this frame for 50 cents. Let's 
Let's make arrangements. I'm your fix when you need maintenance. Call me crazy, awesome baby. I'ma take your love to the max plus 80. Such a wild boy, no need explaining. Love's worth money, you ain't got to pay me. Look me in the eye, cause you want me, baby. Make you love me so much that you fucking hate me. I'ma fuck you, then fuck your friend. And fuck her, cause I fuck this twin. Living life so pure with an inch of sin. Hi. Good. Good, good. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, good. There's a fire, uh, there's a fire chief, yeah. Wow. How are you doing? How are you? Not too bad. All the pieces are in here, right? Okay. Great, great. I'm gonna get this one. Alright, I'm just gonna do this one. Okay. So you said three dollars each. Mm -hmm. okay. Six dollars. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good one. Okay.
Hey everyone, I'm back from yard sales. Let me show you what I found today. Starting off with this frame, I got this for 50 cents at a church sale. I also picked up for five dollars this mini multi-tool and it comes in a little pouch. It's got many pliers, a Phillips, it's got a flathead, um, a nail filer, and a mini knife. Okay, next up, I found this one at a church sale. It's an original Game Boy case, outer shell. It looks like somebody donated this as spare parts because that's all this is, is spare parts. We have the buttons in here, there's several screws. Here's the D-pad button. And this frame here, the screen cover, looks like it's brand new. So it fits good, it just, it's just a, sh a shell, so there's nothing in here. It does have the battery cover, that's good. So if you look closely, here's the model number and the year, 1989 Nintendo. That's pretty cool. I still don't have an original Game Boy, a Nintendo Game Boy. One of these, but in a working condition. But I did find this one for a dollar, so it is just for spare parts. Alright, next up, I got this Monopoly Toys R Us Times Square Edition. I found this at a yard sale for five dollars. Let's check out the inside and see if all the pieces are there. Alright, I got the Monopoly opened up. Looks like it's complete. Got the cash here. Got both dice. Got the community and chance cards. I have six tokens here. Jeffrey the Giraffe, we have uh, the Monopoly guy, keep forgetting his name, we got a race car, we got a Tonka truck, Nerf football, and Mr. Potato Head. Got the property cards here. They're all complete. The instructions, the houses and hotels. And it's weird because they're made of wood, the houses and hotels. That's the back of the container, the case, and the board right here in the back. All right, and finally, I have these two rings here. They're both silver. They do have marks in the insides. I'm gonna show you them under the microscope in a minute. I'm also gonna weigh them for you so you could get an idea of what these are in weight. Let's get a close up. I got each of these rings for $3. The lady that I bought them from claimed that they, none of the rings or jewelry she had there were gold or silver. And I just let her believe whatever she wanted. And I just double checked anyway with my jeweler's loop. So these are the rings. I only found info for this one on Google. This one I didn't find. But I'm going to weigh them now. And we're going to check under the microscope. Alright, first ring. Let's check this one out. Five point seven four grams. Next ring. Four 
4.68 grams. Alright, I got the ring under the microscope. Let's see a closer look of it. I got a 925 there, but it's upside down. Let me flip this over. There you go, 925. If you can see the numbers right there. That's for this ring. So this ring is a Ross Simon ring. Ross Simon 925 silver ring. Here's the ring. It's identical. So this is the brand. This is what it's going for. About that price. Forty to fifty dollar ring. All right, here's the other ring. There's some writing there. Nine two five right there. There you go. Nine two five. The other one, I have no other info other than what I showed you. The engravings inside. So these rings were three dollars a piece. It's nice to add a little silver to the collection. All right, so that's everything that I found today. Hope you liked this video. Smash that like, subscribe, and bell notification buttons. And I'll see you all next time on Bird Brain Gaming. Later, everyone.